Hello everyone, I am Duke James, this is Georgia. Hey, we got 20 ducats from the... from the nobles. Big spenders. Let's see, uh, looks like 18,000 troops coming over here. That's not all of their troops, but uh, close to it. Let's go ahead and see if we can catch one of these stacks. Well, we caught a two stack and... Uh, Okay, they're going to fight 27,000. Yeah, that's perfect, actually. We'll fight them on uh, our territory. All right, another stack wipe. That's uh, what uh, eighteen thousand troops gone. I was thinking peace deal. I'm gonna take these two provinces. It's gonna give me access from here to here. It's gonna make these three provinces worthless for them. It's gonna make this fort uh, really bad. Pretty much, I can just take that fort whenever I want because the. Uh, Fort defense is going to be so horrible on that. And then, uh... Duckets and War Reps. Because this is a... It is a conquest, so... If I do a Holy War, then I think I would have got 75% off the aggressive expansion. But I didn't, so I don't want to take too much. Should be able to grab this fort rather easily as well. The Knights are fighting Bohemia. Ooh, cultural unrest. It's not great. Looks like we're going to have some problems with rebels. Should be fine for now, though. We've lost the effects of plentiful manpower, and then uh, we can pay 50 ducats and get local defensiveness plus 10% in our capital. Yes. I think what I'll do after this, he doesn't have that many more men, so I'll probably skip this and just land over here. keep some troops over here. I have to because I don't have that many uh, transport ships anyway. They, uh... They build a lot of troops. Fast. I don't know if those are mercs or what because they don't have unless they got manpower from their states they for losing 25,000 men and then rebuilding them instantly oh actually you know what it's because they're stack wipes so they get that manpower back forgot about that yeah you get your uh 
I think you get half of the manpower back that you lose in a stack wipe, something like that. Or all of it. I don't think it's all of it, though. Hang out here till the end of the month. Let this uh, garrison replenish a little bit. Actually, it looks like all of his men are walking over here. So I can put 18,000. Um, he only has infantry, so I think that should be fine. We'll take all of the cannon, all of the... Uh, Have, that's what, nine? I think I'll take two less cav. Then these guys will go around and land in Alexandria. Although, he's not moving all of his troops off over here. If Muscovy stays, I think we're fine. I'm gonna throw those guys, those tr uh, ships over there. How about that battle? All right, Muscovy is actually not staying there. Muscovy, what are you doing? Actually, that works out, because we didn't have the uh, three-star general there, so... This guy's a watch over there. Those guys will land. Apparently, we're all retreating. Okay, that's actually... Yeah, it's a lot of troops over here. They'll almost accept this. Alright, I think we can land troops and stack wipe this stack. God damn it, Muscovy, what are you doing? Yeah, must could be lost. Uh, the estates are also restless. Um, mm. We're going to... Really don't want to lose stability doing this. Um, I think we're going to decentralize. That'll help with rebels. 
a little bit and then uh, They didn't get stack wiped, but they lost a lot of their troops. Alright, now we'll load up those troops. Go to Alexandria. So you can't really uh, trust Muscovy in a fight. I imagine they're going to go back here. So they're pretty much out of the fight. All right, let's get those troops back. Alright, the three siege guys should make this go quickly. There they go, building up those troops again. Don't you guys know when to quit? They don't. Hey, Jerusalem, Jerusalem is wide open. We can just take that over. Did start with 900 ducats, so I'm down to 253. But 400 of that went to the uh, church in my capital. Another 50 went to the fortifications in my capital. My vassal has gone bankrupt. I think most of that cost comes from the army. Eight ducats plus the base cost. Pretty much just want to loot uh, Cairo again. Might actually go up here and loot Dumyat because that actually has more... Cash. Only problem with that is, uh, I'd actually like to leave some provinces untouched over here so they continue making that food. Hey, Muscovy, go away. Don't come down here. Cairo really doesn't even have much. I guess we can destroy the buildings and stuff. I 
Don't do that, Muscovy. You're going to lose. You are going to lose. You lost. Alright, we'll go stack wipe these guys. Maybe. Uh, there's another relic. Didn't I already get this? Pretty sure I got this. And then it went away. That's weird, unless it wasn't that province. Huh. I don't know about that. Oh, they have uh, 16,000 men. Alright, I think they want peace. We should probably take... We should probably make peace, because we have 7.82 war exhaustion, so we'll just go ahead and make peace. We'll grab those two provinces, the Ducats war reps. I think in the next war, probably grab Alexandria, and then we'll have a launching point to just go to Cairo. Just immediately get there. But for now, we'll just take these two, split them off from here. Then we'll get a land access. And I have them revoke their guarantee on Karamon. Actually, you know what? I'm wondering if I should have them revoke Karamon or Muntafik. Because I can attack Karamon. Then again, I can attack Muntafik as well. Hmm. Karamon is smaller. Probably in a better position to take Karamon's territory, though. The truce with them ends in eight years, though. Probably have them do both, actually. It just depends on how this fight goes. Do I want to risk this? Um... There's still Tech 19. Or 18. They have five cannon and thirteen thousand troops. You know what? Sure, we'll risk it. We'll see how this goes. I might lose. I don't think so, but uh, if I do... Oh well. I don't think it's going to affect much. Okay. 
all right we won we killed 10,000 of theirs and they killed 4,500 of ours um definitely want to get out now though because I don't want to fight those 10,000 troops ouch um 70 ducats less they will accept so they'll revoke both of their guarantees we get these two provinces 1600 ducats war reps all right I only get a thousand of those ducats All right, we lost 63,000, we actually lost 26,000, and they lost 94,000. All from combat. We lost 15,000 in combat. We also got two cultural unrests in less than five years. I think less than three years, actually. Might even be less than that. That is, uh... I'd say unlucky. We're a great power now. Really want to vassalize the knights. It's just a little bit hard to do that when I can't ally them or royally marry them. But if I'm a great power, I should be able to, uh... influence them, so I'll get 25 from that, and then, uh, okay, I can influence them and take on four in debt. That would be plus 30. Let's go ahead and do that. That bumps them up to 139. All right, I'm going to get all my people back in place and then try to vassalize the knights and then uh, pick it up from there and, uh, yep, yeah, go from there. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next part. Goodbye.